two years ago. Two years yeah. ago, out standing out front, uh, rededicating the park and, and the new sign. And now we're back to uh, an idea that that, uh, that Mike hatched here with, with his family. And it uh, sounded like a great idea. So there's uh, the thanks to Mike for that, for, for bringing us back together. And thanks to Dave Dressel and uh, DPW Department, Bob Moya, you know, getting the park ready. The arrangement of the stones was uh, the city's contribution. And the plaque, of course, is the family's contribution. Uh, and uh, with the, uh, as we said, out plus two years ago, the, uh, the tenure of Mayor Cavanaugh and all he did for Waterleaf, it is uh, only right and proper that we, we uh, commemorate that and uh, keep that in people's minds so that as we go forward and mayor's change over, we know who did what here in the city of Waterloo. So with that, I'll turn it over to Mike and, and the family. Well, Thank you, Mayor. Uh, I want to thank the city for paying attention to the past while uh, being forward-looking. So I think uh, I think it's uh, very very nice that you uh, worked so hard uh, to do this. You mentioned Dave Dressel and uh, David Boop, heaven and earth. Three very heavy rocks uh, to be able to uh, uh, make this happen. Uh, we had hoped to. Uh, get this done in early June, uh, which would have been in time for my father's uh, 100th birthday, but getting bronze plaques uh, made took a little longer than I thought, but uh, Dave made a Herculean effort to try and get it in, in time for that deadline. Uh, so Dave, uh, I want to thank you uh, very much. The. Uh, I won't get into any of the specifics about what my father did. The, uh, do some of the highlights on the on the plaque itself. Uh, suffice it to say that uh, he loved this city, and uh, I think he'd be very honored. Um, one kind of interesting note is that these are canal stones, and this is uh, my research tells me a capstone. Uh, from a lock. My great great grandfather, pardon me, my great grandfather, uh, James Henry Cavanaugh, was a lock keeper on the uh, canal at the lock at 23rd Street, right up here. So I'd kind of like to think that maybe he walked over this stone at one point and uh, kind of adds a significance to it. And uh, it was the city's idea to come up with the using the lock stones, which had had a tremendous amount of uh, uh, relevance to this. Uh, I want to introduce my sister Peggy, my brother Brian, and also mention that uh, there's three of my brothers and sisters who couldn't be here. Uh, my brother Jerry uh, lived, uh, lives in Florida, so uh, he couldn't be here. Uh, my sister Mary Ellen lives in Syracuse. She couldn't be here. My brother Jim passed away about, uh, I guess it's 23 years ago now. Uh, he was a lifelong um, supporter of the city, and uh, his legacy lives on through my nephew Tim, who's also very, very much involved uh, with the city here. So, us Kavanaugh's got an awful lot, and uh, I want to thank the city for providing the anchor stone. So, do Brian want to do the honors? No, I think you should. Why? <laughs> My brother Brian and I were here yesterday in the heat installing the uh, uh, bronze plate here.
Executive Board, a Scoutmaster, and District Commissioner for the Boy Scouts of America, and was praised for his work as Chair of the Albany County Charter Commission. This monument dedicated in 2010 by his loving family in a grateful city. Thank you, Mayor, and thanks to you family and friends for coming out today. Really special. Thank you. Okay. Everybody come on.